Welcome back to the official PDF Element YouTube channel. I'm George. Today, I will discuss how to effectively save a fillable PDF form. If you want to explore more PDF form topics, don't forget to check out our fillable PDF forms playlist. How do you typically save a PDF form? Instead of navigating through file and save as after filling it out, why not simplify the process? I'll guide you on adding a convenient save button directly to the form. Plus, I'll demonstrate how to incorporate a button for saving the filled form as a file and seamlessly resetting it to its original status. If you're curious about how it's done, stick around until the end of this video. First, let's talk about how to add a save button to a fillable PDF form. Begin by opening the PDF form and entering the necessary information. Navigate to the Form tab, select the Push button, and add it to the form. In the Properties panel, rename it to Save Button. Customize the box color and the text style in the Appearance section. Then in the Options section, choose the Label Only with the label name set to Save. In the action section, opt for Execute a menu item. Select Save As from the list of actions, confirm your settings, close the panel, and let's put the button to the test. Clearly, it functions perfectly. I renamed this filled form as Business Membership Form Save Button. Next, I'll show you how to incorporate an auto save feature using a save button allowing you to save the filled PDF form as a new file and seamlessly reset the form template. When dealing with the fillable PDF form as part of your routine office tasks, are you constantly duplicating multiple blank form templates and filling them out individually? You only need to add a button to simplify this complicated working process. Let's go through the process and see it in action. Open the PDF template, fill in the information and head to the form tab. Add a push button, and change the field name to the save button and adjust the appearance. Set the label name to save. In the action section, opt for execute a menu item and choose file save as. Add another action, which will be reset a form beneath the first one. In the action box, you can customize the operation order. For this button's logic, we'll save the file first and then reset the form. Go to the home tab and test the button and save the file as a new one. After saving, you'll notice the form template resets to its original status. This way, there's no need to manually copy and clear the form template information. As we conclude this tutorial, you've now mastered your PDF form workflow. By adding a save button and optimizing its actions, you've streamlined the process of saving and resetting your form templates. This simple yet effective technique eliminates the need for repetitive copying and clearing, saving you valuable time and effort in your routine office tasks. Thank you for staying with me until the end of this video. If this video was helpful for you, I would appreciate it if you could like this video and subscribe to this channel. I will continue bringing you many more videos with tips and tricks to make your work life easier. You can also take a look at the rest of the videos on this channel and there you'll find more helpful videos just like this one. Have a great day and see you next time.